Well, good morning, everybody, on this Tuesday morning. Just dropped off a can at a customer and locked it. That we picked up at CP last night. Ugh. Ugh. So, now heading back to the warehouse. Not sure what's up next. Not sure. Probably deliveries. Actually, there's a 20-foot there that I have to open. I'm not sure what the deal with that is. Am I delivering it? Am I opening it? I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, when I got home last night, checked my mail. My criminal background search was there. And of course, my alias held. My alias held. Ha ha ha. Um, no, seriously, no, I don't have an alias. <laughs> no, I'm all good to go there. Only thing I do is actually go to a clinic now and um, get my my medical done. Got to do that. That's all that's left. Then back everything off to a bunch of companies. Why not? Why just put everything in one basket? Let's spread the love. <laughs> Better chance of me getting the hell out of here. Anyway, so uh, we're heading back to the warehouse for Bobtail. Maybe hit a Tim Hortons on the way back. Maybe not. Anyway, stand by. All right. So this day is turning out to be rather, um, how can I describe this? Bipolar. So um, I come here early to uh, go drop a container off at a customer for 8 o'clock in the morning. And I do. And then um, I'm told, well, there's nothing else till later. And then it's like, oh, come back, return to CA, uh, CAXU, the one I picked up at um, at the port. Well, that's got to go to GT. I was like, oh, they closed 330. Come quick, come quick. So now I'm back because I went home and went to go get my um, my U.S. medical. I was going to go do that. So it's like, oh, come back, come, blah, 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 blah. So I go and say, well, I got to go do this. I got to go do my medical. He doesn't know if to get a new job, though. I said, I got to get my medical. So I get there, it's like, oh, the doctor that does that is not here. Great. That's fantastic. Fantastic. So I got to call ahead next time. Hope, But the clinic's open on Saturday and Sunday, so um, hopefully um, I can hit them. I'm, I'm going to call ahead because I got the number now. Um, plus there's a $125 fee because it's not covered by Medicare. So, and it's cash only. But that's not a big deal. Uh, it's the fact that the doctor wasn't there that does it. And then I gotta come back, and then there's nothing else later in the afternoon, but except I gotta come back again later tonight to uh, do pick up and, and return. Like I said, it's a bipolar day. It's bipolar. Lovely. Anyway, we're heading out to GT to return this can behind me. And then once again, that's gonna be it until, well, later tonight. So that's uh, burning more gas. Anyway, stand by. that was just in front of me. They got a customer in the back. <laughs> yeah, they do. So, this day is still buddy bipolar. Like, one o'clock and it's going my second move of the day. Really? Oh, but there's going to be lots of work tonight. Come early tomorrow. Blah, 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 blah. Harding. Oh, it's a kid too. Well, young adult. Probably someone either in their early, late teens, early 20s. Anyway, stand by. Stand by. All right, so return to GT is done. And now we are going to CN. Maybe. Well, I just got a text with uh, information on it, but 
I haven't had a chance to read it yet because, well, I'm driving. So, I'm going to, um, but I think he mentioned to me that there was a pickup at CN. Before I actually go in, I'm going to check. Anyway, so that's where we're heading. See it? Stand by. I'm in a 2014 Dodge Durango RT.